Hi everyone, it's Pernod. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. This is the third and final video for this Jiffy Stitchery project. I think I've been calling it Jiffy Creations. I don't know why, but it's the title uh, on the project was Jiffy Stitchery, a beginning stitchery kit. So uh, let's go, let's get this done. I'm almost down to the wire. Just a few leaves, some back stitching. Yes, I'm going to complete my mom's project that was probably started in the 1970s. So let's get her done.
Here's the final back stitching. Now, I did look, I did confirm, I read the instructions over and over, and all I need to do is back stitch the white flower, the white zinnia. So it's the only one that needs some back stitching around the petals. I did confirm it. I read the instructions over and over. <laughs> Don't come at me. <laughs> okay, so I need to use the light orange and here we go. We're already started. Let's get her done. With the final back stitching done, there is one other step to do is cut the little loops and make them fluffy. One of the steps in finishing the project was to glue the fabric onto a piece of cardboard. Now the cardboard was attached to the photograph of the project. so. It was pretty handy and that's when I realized oh yeah there's a ribbon I'm gonna need to cut and tie into a bow to place on the project later. Now the cardboard had to be cut down to a certain size. I think it was four inches by five inches. So I went and edited that. But after cutting the cardboard, I took the project off its loop and it had rusted. Oh my God, it was so dirty. I tried to fold it over, see if maybe by gluing where I was gluing it, glue it onto the cardboard, it wouldn't show, but it was bad. So I tried washing it and then I let it dry for a little bit and I, I tried washing it again a second time, scrubbing it. But as you can see, it, I don't see much of a change. So I decided, nope, that's not, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to glue, put glue and glue it back into the hoop because the hoop was all rusted. I'm not gonna use it anyway. Might as well just do what I can and salvage the project this way. Using my handy dandy little white glue, my tacky glue, I use that to help glue the fabric to, uh, to keep it still and stay onto the hoop. And then I used some clothespins that I had, great crafting project aids if I do say so myself, and to help them hold the fabric in its position while it dried. Those pins worked great. They held it all in place and 
Now it was just time to clean off the ends. I was so proud of myself. I've done it. I've completed my first stitching project and it is just beautiful. Look at that. Look at it's stunning. It's wonderful. It's all done. Huzzah for me. Yay. Here we are. Completed project. Now for a side by side comparison with the front picture and oh my God. Okay, we're gonna try this again. Now the big reveal. Now the project is complete. It has the yellow ribbon on it. Huzzah for me, I've done it. I've done my first stitching project. Thank you everyone for tuning in and watching my video. Please consider dropping me a like, maybe subscribe. Thanks again for watching. Bye.